Hello. Tu ce bul de nu te mira de Hello. Tu ce Hello. Learn to answer the phone, Ben Chode. Hello. 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 Good afternoon, sir. This is Alex. How are you doing so far? Good. Uh, sir, we are calling to inform you about some free of cost additional Medicare benefits. We just wanted to confirm you do have Medicare Part A and B, right? Right. Perfect. Uh, just for the qualifying purpose, sir, how old are you? 70. 70, good. Perfect, sir. Sir, you are perfectly qualified for some additional Medicare benefits that has no cost to you. So I'm simply at my senior supervisor on the call for you. He will guide you further. Please stay on the line, all right? Okay. All right, sir. Thank you so much. Hello. Thank you so much for taking my call today. This is David with Medicare Benefits. How are you doing? Good. Sounds pretty good. Well, this call is being recorded for quality and defining purposes. And I saw that you filled an application that you were interested in getting some Medicare codes. So I will going to assist you with the further details and benefits on it. So I just want to know that, do you have Medicare Party and B? Yes. And for the age benefits, how old are you? Can you back away from the microphone a little? Ta, 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 ta. All hey, right. What? Thank you. Oh, I don't know what that was. <laughs> <coughs> I really set him off. <laughs> what a dent show. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Hi. Good, up good afternoon. My name is George Washington. How are you doing today? <laughs> I'm busy fighting the Revolutionary War, just like you. Pardon me? I, I said you're the father of my country. I love you, George. Thank you for calling. I am not that, I am not that George. My could name you, is George Walker. Could you ask Abraham Lincoln to call me later? He's dead. Oh, he's dead? 200 years. Oh, so is George yeah. fucking Washington, you retard. My name's Mahatma Gandhi. How can I help you, Ben Chode? Kokarna Ben Karo, Judah. Now hang up, Mother Jode. Hang up. Don't just sit there breathing. Hang up. Hello? 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 Hi, my name is Jessica, calling you from Senior Benefits. How are you? Uh, I'm doing better than you, Rundy. What do you want? Make it fast. I'm busy. Go. Go. What do you want? Hello. Hello. Good afternoon. My name is Elizabeth Connor. The reason for my call is that the updated plan for Medicare has just been released. Do you have a minute to check what additional benefits you can qualify for? Yes, I do have a minute. Hmm. Okay, so hmm. I won't take too much of your time. What we do here is help you get additional Medicare benefits like flex card, prescription coverage, and food cards at absolutely no cost for which we need to confirm your eligibility. Do you have Part A and Part B of Medicare? Yes, I do. All right, so great. So you do qualify for various benefits with us, such as flex card, food card, and even monthly $180 cash back. I'm connecting you with a senior supervisor for details. Please bear with the music for just a moment. Uh, thank you for calling. This is Jacob. How are you doing today? You doing good? Doing good. God bless.
bless you with a good health. So it looks God like you have Medicare plan benefits or website. So I believe you do have both Medicare Part A and B, correct? That is correct. Beautiful. And, uh, and you, okay, in case we get disconnected, is it the best number to call you back? It's 517-618-9577, sir? Yes. Okay, and how young you are at the moment? What is your age? 70. 70, oh, you sound pretty young over the phone, by the way. Oh. And what zip code oh. are you in right now, in, in the state of Michigan? <laughs> no, it's 70. Wait, wait, how old do I sound? Uh, you sound pretty young over the phone. Like, like what? Maybe in, your, maybe in your 30s or 20s, you know. Wow. Pretty young over the phone. What wow. Is that if I was 20 again, I would let your mother jump on my dick all day. <laughs> Hello? What? That's a compliment to mom. Hello? Hello, this is Kelly from Medicare Alert. How are you today? Good. Hello? Can you hear me? Yes. Well, then continue. Okay, I'm sorry. We help individuals like you stay safe and independent with our advanced medical. Like oh, my goodness. Know. You've bored me to death, Kelly. You've already bored me to death. Hang up, Rondi. You're horrible at this. Hang up. Go home to your bed, Jode. Hang up. Thank you. Hello? 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 Uh, hi, sir. My name is Zach and from Legacy Assurance. How are you doing today? Good. Okay, the reason of my short call is to let you know about final expense and life insurance plan, which is designed to cover 100% of your funeral and budget expenses. So may I know how old are you? I'm 70 years old. 70 mm -hmm. years old, okay. So do you make your own decision? Yeah, always. Okay, so wait. 70 years old, okay, so that's all done from my side. I have a senior supervisor on my line. He will assist you further, okay? Okay. Wait, you're such a nice person. Thank you so much for holding on. This is Zach Wilson with Senior Benefits. How are you doing today? Good. Are you calling about the jungle gym I put on Craigslist? Hello, Zach. Hello? Uh, yes, sir. What can I do for you, sir? Your mother. <laughs> what? <laughs> Hello? Hello? Yeah, this is me speaking. How are you doing today? Who is this? This is Eve with Nationwide Health Insurance. How are you doing today, sir? Fine. Well, good to hear. And the reason of my call is to let you know that this family is providing you health insurance with a wider range of coverage in your area and at low cost, maybe in all cost to you. As it shows me here that you don't have Medicare or Medicaid. Is that correct? That's correct. Okay, and I believe you are under 65, right? That is right. Okay, sir. That means that you might get extra benefits, which will include the dental, hearing, vision, already counter benefits, also discounts on your surgeries, groceries, and utilities as well. Is that okay? And my what as well? You might get additional benefits, uh, uh, like uh, groceries, utilities, oh, uh, discounts okay. on your surgeries. Okay. okay. Uh, yes. Okay. Thank okay. you. Okay, I have a licensed agent on the line waiting for you. 
And if you hear any music, please don't hang up. He'll be providing additional pro uh, information about the program, okay? Okay. Okay, if you hear any music, don't hang up. I'm going to be on the line as well. Okay, thank you. Yeah, hi to you. Oh, this is Marcus on the line. How are you doing today? Good. That's good, sir. Uh, so actually, we are here to get you qualified for the free health insurance that the government subsidies at no cost. And there is no money that you have to pay from your own pocket. So do you have any kind of Medicare or Medicaid, VA or any kind of health insurance at the moment? No, I don't. All right, no problem. As you don't have any kind of health insurance right now, so I can help you out to get the free health insurance and all of the other government subsidies and additional benefits with it. And if you talk about the additional benefits, so that's include a flex card, a cash card that you can use to buy things like groceries for yourself. You can get a food stamp, dental, vision, hearing, prescriptions, and medications. All right? Okay. And if you talk about the health subsidies included with this plan, so that's include money that would be like between $600 to $1,000, something like this in form of a health subsidy. All right? Uh -huh. So right now, so how old are you? What is your age? 50. 50. All right, God, you're in the perfect age, sir. And you're in the state of Michigan. What is your zip code over there? 48226. 48226, thank you. 48226, all right. So, and as of the see you, so right now, you're residing in Detroit, Michigan, right? Yeah, that's right. Thank you. All right, sir. Well, uh, your annual income is less than $65,000? Yes. All right, no problem, sir. Now we're just saying you are on a low income, so you are perfectly qualified to get the free health insurance and all of the other government subsidies and additional benefits for that. So that's an advantage for us. Or do you have any kind of idea, like how much do you make in a year, on a, like 20000 22000 something like this? I think last year I made 28000 Or something like this. So uh, like this year you are projecting to make like twenty five. Like 22 to 25, something like this. Or more than this. Yeah, I like that. One more about All right. Because it is a qualified question that my license is going to ask you. <clears throat> well, not a problem here, sir. And there's just one last thing from the side. Uh, what is your first and last name? First name is spelled J U L E E K. Last name is spelled M A A D. E E K. Okay, it's J U L E E K, right? Right. And then M A. And then an A. And then a D. Uh -huh. And then an E. Uh -huh. Then an E. Uh -huh. Then a K. Uh -huh. All right. How you pronounce your full name, sir? Uh, do you leak my dick? Ben Chode. I said, lick my dick, Ben Chode. Hello? Nothing? That was, that was rude. Hello? Hey, thank you for answering. This is Robert from Senior Specialist with Final Expense Law Cost Insurance Program. How are you doing today? I'm doing better than you, Ben Chode. What do you want? Actually, sir, the reason of this call to let you know that the final expense insurance recently approved in your state that's going to cover 100% of your funeral and burial expenses on low cost. Is that okay? Yeah, that's okay. I like how you pushed through the bench out like it was a term of endearment. Uh, please continue. Actually, sir, may I know for the recorded line, how old are you? I am 70. Okay, sir, you are 70. Let me thank you very much for this. Let me go ahead and check that you are qualified for final experience, final expense insurance program or not. Like, can you please confirm do you have any major health issue like dementia, cancer? Well, I, I don't have dementia or cancer. I have diabetes 1 and 2, high blood pressure, okay. reptile dysfunction, liver spots, back pain, 
genital warts, gender dysphoria, testicle gigantis. I like to wear my sister's clothes. And when I was 12, my mom caught me in the bathroom with a pair of pantyhose. Then my basketball coach kicked me off the team for wearing high-heeled sneakers and acting like a queer. And I have a little poliosis on my ass. But other than that, I am just fine. Okay, so you are just fine. So I am just transferring like these details to my senior agent. If you are calling first, then he will call you back. That would be great. Uh, well, you're just going to hang up on me? <laughs> Hello? 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 Yes. This is Sarah with your electric utility. How are you doing today? Good. So this call is regarding a running promotion under which you will get 30% reduction on your electricity bill. So if you would like to talk to your account representative and claim the reduced rate, please say the word yes. American companies okay, thank you. Thank you. Let me call for your call. Stay with me. Okay, thank you. Thank you for holding the line. This is Calvin. How's the day going so far? I'm doing better than you, Ben Chode. What do you want? What do you want? Actually, sir, actually, we are just reaching you to provide you some discounts on a bill. Because I can see here that you were overcharged on a bill by the mistake from the company side. Okay? I, I don't know what you're talking about, Gandhi. I'm busy right now. Can you call later? Gandhi, can you call later? Yeah, we call you after 15 minutes. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Bye. Hang up. Hang up, Gandu. Sorry? Hang up. Yeah. Hang up. Hello? 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 Good morning. This is Johnson with U.S. Healthcare. How are you? Good. God bless you. I can see here in my system that you have Medicare Part A and B. Is that correct? Yes. Okay. Whenever you go to store to buy your food and groceries, you pay for your food and groceries or Medicare pay for that? I pay for it. That's the reason I'm calling you that we're going to help you and give you $180 up to $300 a month for your food, for your groceries, for your utility bills, and you don't have to pay anything, and you don't have to change your current plan, okay? Are you from the Medicare? Yeah. Okay. How old are you? 70. Okay. So, what's your date of birth, sir? 6 26 1954 Okay and you make your own healthcare decisions by yourself right Right Okay so we're going to send you a flex card a flex card like a debit card you can use in the stores to buy your food and groceries and next time you go to store you don't have to pay for your food and groceries you can just use your flex card there okay How oh. Yeah, is that okay for you? Sounds good to you? Yeah, but how do you use it? You can use it in any store. It's, it's like a debit card. We can send you in the mailing, in your mailing address. And okay. you are residing in our I, state. Yeah. Go, uh -huh. go, please continue. Okay. So you are residing in a state of Michigan, right? Right. What's your zip code over there? 48226. And what's your mailing address that we're going to send you a flex card? 3220 Bent mm -hmm. Bent B-E-N-T Bent Chode Way mm -hmm. Butt Crack, Michigan 48226 mm -hmm. B 
Yeah. You got you know how to spell everything? Can you spell your mailing address? Okay. Three two two zero space hmm. B E N T space C H O D E space W A Y and then the next uh -huh. line is B U T T E space C R A C K space M I four eight two two six. Can you read it back? Can you read it back to me? How do you spell your first and last name? Can you read back the two address lines and then we'll do the name? Hello? I guess you can't. Hello? Hello? Hi, this is uh, Tom Smith. I'm calling with U.S. Financial Tonight at Quarter Line. How are we doing today? Good. Uh, very good to hear. Well, a reason actually why I'm calling and reaching you out, we're just offering a debt relief program for your unsecured debt. I would like to ask, do you have any kind of unsecured debt right now? Credit cards, personal loans, medical bills, you want to pay off these days? Uh, credit cards. The credit cards. And altogether, sir, just roughly speaking, a ballpark figure. How much you think would be the total unsecured debt you have right now? Uh, 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 around 12000 like all your credit cards. Did you hear me? 12000 okay. And do you, have any, do you have any medical bills or personal loans, sir? No. Okay, so just the credit card. So debt relief program, sir, this is only for your unsecured debt. We just want to give you the details about it. Debt relief program is a program where we can pay off all your unsecured debt, sir, and we can make it into one lowest payment with a better rate which suits your financial situation. First of all, we are not asking, sir, to do business over the phone or make any changes. We are here just to tell you that how much we can help you to save and what kind of lowest payment we can offer you by paying this 12000 off. The benefit is you're making right now different different payments on different cards with different rates. We'll give you just one payment with a better interest rate. If you think the numbers are making sense, if it suits you financially, give us a call, sir. If not, so there is no obligation and obviously no cost on you. Just leave it right there and keep it as it is. I just want to ask, do you had a bankruptcy, sir, in the past two years? No. No, oh, perfect. And currently, sir, the debt 12000 are you making payments on it or are they under collection right now? Making payments. That's very good of you. And for these 12000 of unsecured credit card debt, are you working with any other companies? No. No, perfect. And lastly, sir, how much you think is your FICA score these days? Like maybe 500, maybe 600, or maybe better than that? Oh, it's really, it's pretty high last time I checked. Like 700, 750. I, I think it was... 1190, 1200, something like that. Uh, oh, I, I think you're not living in the United States, then, sir. No, how high does it go? Because I was right up there near the top. The max you can go to 850. Okay, how, then how, I, maybe I was like 840. Maybe I was like 11 or 840, I mean. I don't know. It's been a while. I don't really care. I just know that it's good. Okay. And how much do you pay, by the way, on this 12000 every month, sir? Uh, I pay about... I'd have to check. Can you hang on? Maybe I can find I'm my just bills. A like the, just an, just a I'm sure I can wait. Oh, it's, a, it's around... Um, it's around 300 Now, If I'm late, though, they charge probably like an extra 100 in interest in fees okay. so it's so, i mean uh, so is, are you making minimum payments or that's over the minimum oh i yeah that's probably over i pay as much as uh, on it as i can every month got it okay well we can have uh, we can let you know what we can do sir and then hey, wait, how can much think about it if, hey where where you, around where you live how much does a bowl of chilled monkey brains cost what do you think? Hello? Ben Jode? Just hang up on me. Hello? Uh, hi, ma'am. 
morning. This is Mark Sigmund. How are you doing today? Doing good? Yes. Good. Uh, good to hear that. May God bless you with good health. Well, I am calling you from Senior Benefit to let you know that you are perfectly qualified to get some new additional benefits on top of your Medicare free of cost along with your some new additional benefits on top of your Medicare without any additional cost to you. So just to uh, confirm me, do you have Medicare Part A and B? Is that correct? That is correct. Uh, white, wonderful, and uh, just for each qualification purpose, just to confirm me, I see here you are 69 years old. Is that correct? That's old. I'm 70 now. Oh, you are 70? Yeah. Okay. And, okay, it means, sir, you know what? You are perfectly qualified to get all these additional benefits without any additional cost to you. And the thing is that you don't need to change anything to get these benefits. Like, we are providing you all these benefits with your same plan that you have already right now. Can you back up a little bit? Anything. Back up a little bit. You're giving me a headache. I said... Thank you. You don't need to... I said you don't need to pay a single penny from your pocket to get these benefits. So, just to confirm me that, do you make your own health care decisions by yourself? Or you have a um, legal power of attorney? Uh, by myself. I. It sounds like the, all the words come out of your nose. What are you doing? Hello? Could you try and talk like a human? You sound like a giant bug. You sound like a giant bug. You call me, try to get a bug in my butt. Hello? What you talking about? Yeah. What you talking about, Willis? What you talking about, Willis? Okay, Ar Willis. is your I'm name Arnold? I am Jonathan. Your name is Arnold. Jonathan. Oh. I told you that. Different strokes to rule the world. Hello? Hello? Hello. Hi, sir. My name is Cameron. How are you doing? Good so far? Yes. All right, so good to hear that. Uh, so actually, this call is about final expense, which is designed to cover 100% of your funeral and burial expense. So just for the qualified purpose, may I know how old are you? I'm 70 years old. Seventy. That's pretty perfect. And why is it perfect? Sir, how do you spell your? Sir, why is it better than sixty-nine? I don't get it. Uh, by sorry. You said it was perfect. Your age. Your age is sixty-nine. No, seventy. You said seventy was perfect. Why is 70 better than 69 or 65? Okay. I, I don't understand what you're talking about. All right. Have a you're a... Oh, he got away. He got away. I was cocked and loaded, but I didn't get the fire at him. Hello. Hello, this is an important call from Amazon Customer Support. This is to notify you regarding your today's purchase on Amazon. I already pressed nine. Thank you for calling Amazon customer service. How can I help you today? Well, I just, I didn't call. You called me. You told me to press nine about the order. Well, well, I just got a notification about your pre-authorized purchase on this register number. And your phone number is 
7618985 It's your number? That's right. You just called it, so I would so assume you had Pardon me? Did you purchase an Apple laptop and Apple Airport? No. No? I said no. You're going to have to start listening to what I and say. I can see. As I can see in my system, there is an order has been placed on this register number for purchase of the merchandise that is an Apple laptop and Apple Airport amounting to $1,599. And it's delivered today. The shipping address that is 49 Arcadia Code, Albany, New York. The code is 12205. So are you there at this address? Did you say Albania, New York? Yes, sir. No, that's not my address. Can you verify me your first name and a last name so I can check in my system? Yeah, it it should be it shouldn't be Albania, New York. It should be Lithuania, New York. Can you verify me your first name and a last name? Yes, I can. Are you ready? Yes. First name is M I K E. Last name H A W K S A R D. Just like the bird. H A W K E. H A W, not double K. W. And then one K, and then S A R D. Can you say it back so I know you got it correct? Your first name is Mike, right? Mike, Mike. There's an E. There's an E on the end. M I K E. There's an E on the end. Mike. Go ahead, say say it again so I can verify both names. Your first name is Mike. No, just say Mike. my names. I want to hear one word, two words, which would be my first name. My, I don't want to hear anything else. Mike Oxford, right? Yes. Every time you see a dude. Right, the cell phone number? You just said it. You have it already. Five one seven six one eight nine five seven seven. Yeah, it's the same phone number or your home line number. Well, which one do you need to get into my Amazon account? Hello, I don't know where that accent was from. Was he just an odd bench out, or was he from somewhere else? We'll have to see. Hello? Hello, can you hear me? I hear you. Yes, sir. My name is Michael calling you from Healthcare Solutions. How are you today? I'm good. Good to know that, sir. Actually, we are offering you the hospital indemnity plan. That will help you to take care of all of your copies that you are paying out of your pocket and provide you some addition benefits. Onto your policy. <laughs> Let me just <laughs> confirm that. How old are you? What's your age? What's so funny, Gandu? Hello. Hello. Yes. This is Sophia. How are you doing today? Good. This is good. You said. Well, the reason of my call is to add some more extra benefits into your current plan, like cashback up to two hundred dollars, grocery flex card, food stamp, utility benefits, over the counter benefits, and if you are paying any copayment, that will be that amount will be totally eliminated from your plan. Is that sound good to you? That sounds 
Great. Great. Okay, for that reason, I do believe you have active medical part A and part B both. Yes, I have active do medical have part A and part B. Good. And by the grace of God, how old are you, sir? I'm 70. You are 70. Well, you are qualified for the Medicare. Uh, Medicare. That's all from my side. Now I am going to transfer you your call to the senior supervisor. Just stay online. It may take a moment. Okay, I'll stay online. Line. Thank you. Stay yeah. online. You're welcome. I will connect. Take a moment. Okay. Hi, this is Peter. How are you doing today? Good. Yeah, I just came to know that you are willing to move with the extra benefits and you're 70 years old. That's right? That's right. Perfect. And you have Medicare Part A and B? Yes, I do. Perfect. And your zip code is 72855. That's right. That's right. Perfect. Can I have your first and last name, please? First name is Mike, M-I-K-E. Last name is H. M-I-K-E. Last name is H. Last name is? H-A-W-K. Can you spell it? Okay, stop talking and I'll spell it. H-A-W. H-A-W-K-S-A-R-D. Just like the bird. Okay. Yeah, Hawksward. Yeah, say the whole name so I can verify. Yeah. It's Mike Hawksworth. Yeah, every time you see a dude. Right? Yeah, this one, right? Or, or for goats. I don't know. Perfect. Thank it's you. from my side. Thank you. on the line. It will take a few minutes of yours, and you will be provided with the benefits. Now I'm going to transfer your call to the next person. He will just verify your details and provide you all the benefits. Okay? Just stay on the line. It will take a few minutes of yours. Okay. Did you hear what I said? What? Okay, thank you. Thank you for calling Optimum Quotes. This is James on a recorded line. How are you doing today? Good. I'm doing good. Very good. Now, would you like to get some extra benefits, like the money for your food, crossways, and a cash back? Yes. All right. And let me start by confirming your information on our website and see if we can possibly help you by having a licensed agent. We're going to review your Medicare options and check other additional benefits that may help to meet your medical needs and the budget. Now, do you have Part A and B? Part A and B what? Medicare Part A and B. Do you yeah. have that? Yes, I do have that. All right. And do you get any extra help from the Veterans VA, TRICARE, from your previous employer? What was the first one? Veterans. Oh. Benefits from the Veterans VA. Yeah, I, 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 Veterans. <laughs> <laughs> you sound so stupid. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> I blew that one. The Veterans. <laughs> <coughs> Oh, I'm still not over that cold. The veterans, so stupid. Hello. Pardon me, I didn't understand. Hello. Hello. Yeah, this is Kevin calling you from Senior Care Benefits. How are you doing today? Good. Good. Spit it out. What do you want? That was weak. Hello. 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 Yes, my name is Sam. How are you? Good. I'm calling you from AccidentalClam.com. You have any car accident in last two years? Yes, I did. Okay, so which year your accident happened in 2023 or 2024? 
2024. Which month? February. February 14th. February 14th. And, uh, and you were injured in this accident, like leg pain, back pain, shoulder pain, anything like that? Yeah, just like that. Okay. And so, uh, after the accident, you visit to the hospital, I'm right? You are right. Okay. And so, which state are you living right now? I live in Arkansas. Okay, and what's your five digit zip code? 72855. 72855. Okay, and say uh, you have a police report in this accident? Yes. Okay, I got you. So you're perfectly qualified for compensation money, like hundreds of thousand dollars. So, uh, as <clears throat> Uh, how do you pronounce your beautiful first and last name? Victor Van Vivavi. Can you spell it me, your first name? V-I-C-T-O-R. V-I-C-T-O-R. Uh, and what's your last name? The spelling? Yeah. I already told you my last name. Okay, can you spell it me your last name? Yeah, V I V E V I V V I L W I L L E V V Y. Oh my God. Say it back so I can make sure you got it right. Say it back. Okay, I. Say it back. No, you didn't. Say it back. You're lying to me. Say it back. Say it. And Chode? I think, oh yeah, he hung up on me. Well, I forget who told me to use that name, but you just scrambled his brains. So good work. Hello? Hello? Yes. Hi, good afternoon. This is John Murphy. How are you doing today? Good. God bless you, sir. Well, sir, this call is all about a new low-cost final expense program that covers your funeral and burial expenses. So just to make you qualify, how old are you right now, or sure age? I'm 70. 70. That's perfect, sir. I got it. And sir, in the age of 70, you make your own decision or someone helps you? Uh, you make... Uh, I make my own decisions. You make Okay, that's perfect. You are perfectly qualified. Hello? Yeah, I'm here. Can you hear me? I'm here. David, me. David, me. He's in the area. There you go. You got a bad connection. Thanks for connecting on. This is Steve Hamley. How are you today? I'm doing better than you, Ben Chod. What do you want? What do you want? I want your goat. sister. No, you want my goat. Hello? 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 Hi, good afternoon. This is Chris calling you from Dead Relief Center. How are you? From, from what? Dead Relief. Oh, okay. I'm fine. The purpose I'm calling you is to let you know that we are running a nationwide campaign for the people, sir, who have unsecured debts. So do you owe any unsecured debts? Yes, I do. How much is it? Uh, it's like $18,000. Okay. Now, is that on your credit card or is that a personal loan? Personal loan. Okay. And are you current on your payments or have you fallen behind? I am still current. You're still current on the payments, that's good, sir. Okay, and have you filed for the bankruptcy in the past two years? No. Okay. 
Now, what we're going to do for you, sir, today we're going to provide you a free consultation. That's how low we can go with your debt and uh, how long it will take to get you completely debt free. So, okay. Would you like to know the options that we have for you? Yes. Okay, guys. And uh, you are here in Michigan, correct? Yeah, that's right. Now, I did go bankrupt about 10 years ago. Does that matter? Yeah, yeah, I, I, it wasn't really my fault. I invested heavily in canned monkey brains. <laughs> and then the market crashed because of Diwali or something, I forget. And then the monkey brain market just hit rock bottom. And I lost everything. Okay, I got it. But now you're not bankrupted. It was oh, no, that was ago. 10 years ago. Monkey brains are doing great now. People <laughs> love it. It's like ice cream over there. Okay. And I was asking you, sir, what is your zip code? 48226. And how do you pronounce your last name? Uh, it's pronounced Aiden Kak. Hello? You ra you racist against the Aiden Kak people of America? Hello? Yeah, hi, James? Yes. Yes, hey, James, my name's Brian. I'm with United Screening Center on a recorded line. Just calling about your hereditary genetic test. It is a benefit to your current health care. And the test, it is designed just to catch any type of disease or disorder that may be passed along your bloodline. So my job is just to ask a couple of questions here. I have your date of birth here, 929 of 46. Is that correct? Yeah, that's right. Okay, perfect. 929 of 19. Okay, and then James, have you or anyone in the family been diagnosed with any cancer in the family? No. No? Okay, no cancer in the family. What about Alzheimer's, dementia, or Parkinson's? Uh, Parkinson's is a yes. Okay, who had the Parkinson's? Well, you know, I made out with Michael J. Fox back in the 80s, and I think that's where I got it. Oh, man. Yeah. Okay, what, you have Parkinson's is what you're saying? I caught it from Michael J. Fox after making out with him for about an hour. Oh, wow. Um, well, I don't think, yeah, uh, I don't think that's how Parkinson's work sir that's what i was always told <laughs> i'm not a dummy okay. mister i'm not a dummy i know things yeah yeah no I, I i'm not saying you are but i'm just saying parkinson's is usually passed along the family um you know your genes that's why i was asking if um anyone in the family has parkinson's yeah yeah that's i wore his genes after we made out that's what you wore his jeans. Yeah, after we made out. What, what kind of jeans does Michael J. Fox wear? Well, back then it was. Uh, wait, don't tell me. Calvin Klein. Remember the movie? <laughs> Calvin Klein. Remember? What? Back to the back. Yeah, to the that's it. That's it. <laughs> hey, hey, man, okay. you're a, you're a good sport. I'm not James. You got the wrong number. Okay. All right. Talk All right, to you later. Wrong number here. Yeah. All bye. Right, sir. All right. Hello. Hello. How are you? Is uh, Mr. Howell available? Mr. What? Mr. Howell. How do you spell it? 
H O W E L L. H O W E L L. Are you looking for Thurston Howell? No. What's the who are you looking uh, me for? Howell. Pardon me? Me Howell. Me, me Howell. Me M E Howell. M I. M I. M I Howell. <laughs> You, you are, it's how, it's Howell, Michigan. It's a city and state, you stupid idiot. I mean. Well, sir, it says me, Howell. Yeah, Howell, Michigan. It's a city and state. It's not someone's name. Where are you calling from? It, 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 are you in Pakistan? It, it, you calling me from Pakistan? But it could be correct. And it could it's not be. It, it could so not be. Time. It could not be. You're so stupid. No one is named me. It, Oh, oh, yeah. If <laughs> someone named me, are you looking for some Ting Wong, one hung low? Me, Howell, you're stupid. Oh, he's gone. Hello. 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 Hi, this is Adam with the US Auto Warranty. How are you doing? Doing good. All right. Well, this call is about your car warranty and the prices of car warranty have been dropped down up to 40%. So we are offering you a car warranty for five years with 100,000 additional miles in which all major and minor breakdowns of your vehicle will be fully covered by our side. So may I know what kind of vehicle do you got right now? How many additional miles did you say? 100,000 additional miles. A hundred thousand? Okay, yeah. that sounds good. Yeah. So what's the make and model of your car, sir? Got a 1946 Mahindra Jeep. All right. Sir, do you have any other car? Oh, this is the only one you got. Well, I, I keep the Mahindra in a showroom. I... All right. What? I do have another car. Hello? Are you still there? Hello? Hello? How are you? I'm good. Thank you so much for asking. How are you? I'm so glad you finally called. Oh, okay. <clears throat> By the way, sir, this call regards to final expense whole life insurance plan, which is designed to cover the 100% cost of funeral, burial, or cremation expenses. And these plans are designed for the people who are on the fixed income, social security, or disability income. So I do have the product specialist online who would like to provide you the quick code over the phone right now. Just for the qualification purpose, may I know how old are you today? I'm 79 years old. Oh, okay, sir. As you told me that you are 79 years old, so at the age of 79, do you make your own financial decision? You were supposed to come over last night. Sir, sir? You said we were going to watch Little House on the Prairie. I had to watch it without you. Mary Sue fell down a well. Sir, it's about... Sir, I can't understand what you are trying to say. I said... What do you mean? Mary Sue fell down yeah. the well, and then Mr. Jefferson had to go to town and get Wheezy, and they pulled her out of the well just barely. If it wasn't for Lassie, the Bradys would have never known. Oh. That they you missed a really oh. good show. It was, it was good. Then Perry Mason came, and he tied it all together. It was a good one. Are you gonna come over tomorrow? Okay. Uh, little no. the, Little House on the Prairie is on Saturday nights too. Why does sir? Are you smoker or non-smoker? Well. I still have my pipe. 
I don't know how you feel about that, but I like the smell of tobacco weed. Do you have an active checking or saving account? Yeah, hang on. Let me get my... Okay, you ready? I was just about to read you my checking account number. Why did you hang up? Hello? 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 Yeah. Hello, this is Malden from U this is Malden from US Healthcare. How are you doing today? Doing good today. God bless you. God I bless you less. Call call for you. Sorry? I said God bless you. God, thank you very much, sir. So actually this is a follow up call for you from the marketplace department. And you knew that sir, you're just adding in the state of Michigan and you have a healthcare to the marketplace, right? Well, I'm not in Michigan anymore, so... Oh, which state are you running right now? Arkansas. Arkansas. Okay, and which plan you have with the marketplace? Like Ambassador, Blue Cross, Blue Shield, Aetna, Cigna, United Healthcare, Moline, Oscar? United Healthcare. United Healthcare. And how old are you right now? 50. 50, perfect. And beside your United Healthcare, sir, you not have Medicare, Medicaid, or any type of other coverage, right? Right. Perfect, sir. And so do you remember uh, the last uh, zip code of your uh, previous address of your state of Michigan? Yeah, I remember it. Yeah, what's the zip code of the state of Michigan? 48226. 48226. Perfect. Okay, you're perfect. Congratulations, sir. Today you are perfectly eligible to get your new additional benefits or your current on the marketplace. That's why I'm calling you today. And you're doing really about to be anything for that, and you're doing really about to change anything, okay? Okay. Okay. So what can you do for you, sir? I'm a licensed insurance agent with me on this line on United Healthcare Department. When the licensed insurance agent come on the line, you simply let them know I have United Healthcare to the marketplace and I'm qualified to get my additional benefits, okay? I just got one question. Sure. Go ahead. I I called United Healthcare and they told me they don't have uh -huh. <clears throat> they told me they don't have uh -huh. any they don't have any call centers uh -huh. in India. So why are you calling me from India? India? Yeah. No, sir. This is not called from the India, sir. This is uh, from, from the, the India marketplace department on the Tampa, Florida. Oh, Tampa, Florida. Tampa, Florida. Yeah. You know, okay. you knew there was a hey. Listen, you knew there was a hurricane in Tampa, Florida yesterday, right? Did you know yes. that? Hurricane Louise. Yes, I know that. So why are you at work when there's a hurricane? Sir, uh, our uh, offices are far away from that, sir, so you didn't worry about that. Okay, sir, no, you're not. You're in Tampa, you dumbass. Tampa is underwater right now. Are you gargling? How do you breathe? Please wait while I connect your call. I can't believe you still put me through. Just the line, okay? Okay, I'm seconds. holding. The number you have dialed is not... Oh. Just give me a second. Just give me a second. Just give me a second here. The number you have... Just give me a second. I bring in my license insurance agent. To give you all the benefits, if you not need help to the marketplace. Okay. So just stay in line with me. The number you have dialed, just give me a second. I really appreciate the time and your patience. Is this your first, so you have to be is this your please. first day? You're not very good at this. Huh? What? I said, is this your first day? No. Oh, okay. Totally believe you. Can you hear me? I hear you. Yeah, so just stay in line. Just stay in line with me, okay? Just stay in line. Um, bring your values in on the line. You know all the benefits. The number you have... 
Oh, no. Close to the line. I really appreciate your time and patience. Just in line with me. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, here we go. Hello. Hello, this is Michelle with the APA. I'll be helping you with a federal subsidy that qualifies you for zero premium health benefits today. Can you verify your SIP code, please? Uh, 72855. Hello? Can you hear me? 72855. And which panel? Yeah. Are you, are you calling about the drunk 3PO's butter dish I had on Craigslist? Hello? No. You're not calling? Uh, about the federal subsidy. Is that federal? No, I, I put a butter dish for sale on Craigslist. People have been calling for it all day. It's still available. Okay, I'm still here. Please wait while I connect your call. Hi, this is James Bitters, licensed agent with the Healthcare Enrollment Center on a recorded line. Do you currently have Medicare, Medicaid, VA, TRICARE, or employer coverage? No, I don't. Okay, not a problem, sir. What's your date of birth and zip code? Uh, zip code is 72855. Date of birth is 626-1974. Okay, I know I'm about two months late, but happy belated birthday, sir. And who do I have the pleasure of speaking with today? What's your first and last name, sir? Hi, my name's Mike. Are you calling about the John Deere? No, sir. No, sir. And let me ask you, are you in the state of Arkansas? Yeah. Yeah. I got the John Deere for sale. I got it on Craigslist. Is that what you're calling about? All right. We actually, we actually don't service the state of Arkansas, sir. You have a good one, Steve. Okay. Fuck. <laughs> He let out a little F word. <laughs> uh, my that old cold is still making me cough. That was a good one. It's loaned money. Hello. It's secure. Hello. My name is Mike. My name is Mike. I'm calling you from Senior Benefits for Waterloo today. Good. This call is about a new low-cost final expense insurance, which is designed to cover 100% your funeral and burial expenses. So how old are you? I'm 70. 70, got you. And I believe you max on your health care decisions, right? Right. All right, and you are still residing in Michigan? Yes. What's the zip code down there, sir? 48222. 48222. It's a 48222, right? No, I said 4, 8, and then 32s. Got you. And how do you pronounce your first and last name, sir? Oh, my first name's Pat. P A T. P A T. Last name is. And your last name? H I S K O K. Just like the city. H I S K O K. Yes. Hello? I got you. Okay. Uh, yes, Matt, but I, I'm here. All right, and uh, by the way, how's the day going so far? So good. So good. So good. Yeah. All right. All right. And sir, uh, do you have any kind of disease like kidney dialysis, heart failure, and Alzheimer's? No. I got you. And do you have any active checking or saving account? Yes. All right. 
and uh, <coughs> if you like our plans who would be your beneficiary like son spouse daughter well i'd probably have to share it with all my kids so i've got troy david mark jerome and then the adopted ones tushar and little pajita i got you and your sons right well pajita is a girl's name so there's one daughter all right now tushar and pajita tushar and pajita are adopted does that matter I, know. I don't have documents. I don't have documents for them. We we adopted them in Bombay. Uh, we brought them back to the USA in pet carriers to get them through customs. Won't be a problem, will it? Hello, sir. Are you there? I'm here. Sir, if you like our plans, who will be your beneficiary? Like son, spouse, daughter, wife? Yeah, yeah, my sons and my daughter. I was telling you about little, okay. little Tushar and little Pajita. Now, we brought them back to the country in pet crates. So they will they will bark on command. They're very good at it, pretending to be animals. All right. All right, sir. And sir, we are providing you different coverage plans. Would you like 5,000, 10,000, 15,000 or more? Uh, probably more. I have... There's six of them, so, you know, it has to, whatever it is, it has to be divided by six evenly. 6,000, 12,000, 18,000, 24,000, 30,000, 36,000, 42,000, 48,000, 54, or 60,000 would probably be the, probably top out around 60. Maybe we could do six 10,000s. Instead of one sixty, I don't know. You're the expert. Well, whatever you say. Sir, we are providing you different coverage plans. Like, who will be you? Hello. Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Okay, write these I'm names down for my beneficiaries: Troy, then David. Hello. You didn't even get to little Pajita. You racist. <laughs> Say that again louder. Oh, he's gone. Now sing it. Oh, that was nice. You got a good voice, Gandu.